Shib price recently hasn't really been doing a whole lot. It's mostly been trading sideways, and honestly, that is okay. I am 100% okay with sideways trading at this time. Obviously, we're still in a bear market, and I'd rather see that than prices continuing to drop to try to get down into those, those trenches that we saw late last year. Now, this is obviously what the chart looks like. Again, sideways trading. It's actually uh, kind of a descending triangle. We'll obviously see how this, this plays out here. But what is happening during this time is there are those that are still building their bag. They are continuing to accumulate, specifically whales. Whales have been in big accumulation mode during this time. And in fact, our big old friend, Blue Whale 0073, just bought 99 billion SHIB. Okay, that equates to just over a million dollars. Now, you might not you might say that that's not that much. Well, it's bigger than probably most of us have and she being you right now, right? <laughs> but the point is, is some people are trying to play games and and game the system, get in, you know, lower buying po- lower uh, price points, DCA, stuff like that. And anytime someone liquid- liquidates their bags, there are people there to pick it up for lower prices. And I think sometimes people forget that. We well, can only play that game for so long because eventually the price will leave you behind. Just look at any of the prior market cycles and you can see exactly how that has played out for those that have sold. We hear the stories all the time about people, oh yeah, you know, I didn't think it was going to go up anymore, so I sold my bag. And then they look, they they forget about it, they look years later and they're like, oh my gosh, I lost out on a billion dollars. That's what can happen because crypto does move quickly. It moves quickly in both directions, right? Some people, they panic when they see a sharp drop, but realistically, most of the time, that's just opportunity. If you have a project that is is going through and building and developing and still garnering adoption during that time, that's a huge opportunity. You essentially just got a massive discount on whatever you're looking at. Now, not all of them, I have to say, obviously, this is not financial advice, do your own research, but not all of them are going to stand the test of time. There's not room in the crypto space for everyone right now. And frankly, there is some tech that is better than others. There are some that will have more adoption than others. And even though something may be a good project, if it's if it's small and can't garner that, that interest, it may fail. So just be careful. To, as to what you put your money in, I guess that's kind of my my cautionary tale for the day. Luckily, I've never I have been lucky so far. I've never had that happen. I've gotten out of stuff at the right time, and I look towards mostly blue chip cryptos now, ones that are are standing the test of time, that are going through active development, ones like Shiba Inu that are building big ecosystems that are going to dominate the crypto space. So be aware of what is going on. It's the reason why I talk about whale accumulation as much as I do. It's the reason why I bring up reports like I brought up because, you know, we are, uh, we're getting close to that time, guys. I think that that time where the market's going to explode is going to get very, very close here very soon and just don't get left behind. So appreciate you guys as always. As always, this is not financial advice. Do your own research, but appreciate you guys. Have a wonderful Friday and I hope to catch you in the next one.